Now it's time for arguably the most important part of the backyard camp out, which is the snacks. Now I've got a particular snack that we're gonna be getting ready, s'mores. They are just absolutely to die for. But the first thing that we have to do before we can have an authentic s'more is we've got to build a fire. Now, the most important thing with building a fire, first of all, is making sure it's safe. You don't want to do it undercover. You want to make sure it's nice and clear. And then you're looking for any little kindling that you can find. You want to start small, the smallest sticks possible, and maybe dry grasses, things like that. And then you just build up from there. We've already got it all set up. The most important thing with building a fire is that everything's kind of like a big pyramid. It's got to all build up. There's got to be plenty of space in between your sticks to give your fire room to breathe. Because what a fire needs is fuel and oxygen. That's it. This looks pretty good. See this really nice dry stuff here? That's perfect. Okay, let's get this sorted in here. And I reckon this is probably my favorite part of camping. I love building a fire. It's so nice. There's something so peaceful about building the perfect fire, sitting back, watching, everyone can just enjoy, and it's a good sense of accomplishment. Okay, so we've got the stick set up here. I've got my lighter ready to go. Okay, let's do this. Let's see how we go. Okay, starting to take shape. Once everything starts to catch, you want to have bigger logs on hand. You start with really tiny sticks and just get bigger and bigger and bigger until eventually you can put these nice big ones on and they create those really good hot coals. The most important part of a s'more is the marshmallow. So you've got to have those nice simmering coals down in there to get a really, really good temperature on your marshmallows. I've done this before. I know how it's done. That is looking good. Really, really good. All right, time for some larger logs. Let's go. Yeah. Nice. See, that's all about stacking it up, letting your fire breathe. All right, it's time to put a big log on there. Here we go. There he is. Don't worry if it kind of all falls in on itself. It'll eventually start back up again. That's looking good. I think we are almost s'mores point. It's going to get pretty exciting. Okay. Now, here's a little something I prepared earlier. Bear with me. Have a look at this. Oh yeah. So we've got everything ready to go here. We've got our marshmallows, chocolate and little graham crackers. Now, this is kind of a tradition for the American campfire, but wherever you are in the world, you can kind of improvise. All you need is a nice big marshmallow, bit of chocolate, and some kind of sweet cracker. Anything you can find will do, but this is the good stuff. Now, you're gonna need a good roasting stick. This one looks perfect. Take your marshmallow, and everyone is a little bit different with how they roast a marshmallow. This fire is massive, and it is not dying down, so we're gonna have to be really quick here. We're gonna have to kind of sear it. Let's see how we go. So you want to just turn it, yep, that's looking good, that's looking good, that's looking good. Oh, yep. Oh, nice. Very nice. I like a very well, oh, that's on fire. <laughs> I like a very well toasted marshmallow. That's perfect. That's still on fire. Now, the most important thing is you wait, wow, that's really bad. <laughs> that is like charcoal. But it's all right, because you can always just peel it off. Yeah, oh, look at that. Look at how gooey that is in there. Oh, amazing. Mm. That's perfect. Okay. So now, you want to make sure your marshmallow is warm, but not too hot. And then, you create the sandwich. Here we go. Oh, look at that. Oh, and you know it's a good marshmallow if it's sticking to the stick like that. Oh, wow. Oh, and if it's still warm, that's the secret. If it's still warm, you put that chocolate on it and it just melts. It all just melts together. Oh. Put a little hat on there. And that 
my friends, is a s'more. Let's go. Call me Gordon Ramsay. Here we go. Mm. Mm. That's where it's at. If it's, if you don't come out a giant sticky mess by the end of this, you haven't done it right.